is here, baby! 99 Shohei Otani, the new Takashi Okazaki collection, is in the game. We, I, I doubt we discovered him, but who knows? That would be pretty cool, huh? Get my name etched in there. They'd I'll probably say it's not me. <laughs> Just uh, don't want that association. But he's here. 99 Takashi Okazaki Shohei Otani. We're going to get gameplay with him in just a little bit. Leave a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. And let me know in the comment section how close you are. We're going to talk about some things that you guys are going to need to know about this guy right here. So without further ado, I have no idea what the stats are. Let's fucking see him. No sinker. That is a choice. That is a choice. Now... One could argue the ethics of giving him a sinker. He does have a slider primary. Hmm. What about a... What about an outlier? He does have an outlier, and he gets live series quirks. Okay. No sinker, but I'm still rock hard. Just to let you know what's going on behind under the desk here. Um, okay. Let's get a full glance here. 114 hit 9. 110 K per 9. 98 BB9. So at parallel 2, triple dig... Uh, on his per nines. Very good. Hard to be too much better. Max power versus right. 111 contact. Right. 103, 105. Very respectable against those damn southpaws. Of course. Uh, I'm going to hear this question. Uh, can he play as a outfielder? Of course he can't. It's 2022. We simply do not have the technology available to make this card, you know, play at both outfield and starting pitcher. You pick one or the other, damn it. This is a small indie company of Sony. They, they just don't have the funds. Maybe the PlayStation 7, we're going to be able to do that, but not right now. Uh, the pitch mix, very good. You would like to see the sinker, but with outlier in the pitch speed differential. He's still going to be very good. I know people are going to bitch that he doesn't have that sinker. And I'm people. I I did that too. That's the first thing I noticed. Um, but it's very good. 114, 110 K, and he's the best, you know, he's one of the best hitters, you know, if you squint a little bit. If you just imagine that it says 125, not 105. He's really good. By far the best hitting pitcher in the game. You know, rivaling uh yeah, I don't know. Tyler Glass now, for sure. Uh, neck and neck, almost. But is he worth it? You're going to ask. 26 cards. There's currently 27 in the game, um, not including Shohei Otani, of course. So you can only skip one currently, but there is another one. You know, just like uh, fucking Yoda, there is another one, right? It's not just Luke. Uh, there's Leia, too. And there's another Takashi. Coming tomorrow, that is going to be free in the World Series program. Uh, the postseason program, I should specify. We're getting three classics. Um, we saw it's 99 Springer. We're getting a 99 Solar from last year. 16 Astros in Philly postseason classics uh, or flashbacks from this year. So anybody who even got a hit is probably going to get a card. Uh, Harper, probably a championship series card from him. Jeremy Pena, going to get a World Series MVP card. We're going to see a lot of great stuff tomorrow. Again, that was, uh, you know, moved to Wednesday. But you're getting a free Takashi card. That's the big thing. I don't know if it's going to be Reggie Jackson. I don't know exactly who it's going to be. That's, you know, the going on guess there. Uh, they couldn't put him out in October, so... He's going to be Mr. November from here forward. Uh, let's just see. Did I discover him by chance? Rough. It was Bird. Damn you. Damn you. I completely regret doing this now. Uh, I do think he's good. I don't know if you need to spend the stubs for him because it is astronomically expensive, of course, um, to get some of these cards if you have not been preparing for a while. I mean, look at Walter. He's max price, and you have to wait in a 206-person queue. Is there even two? No, there's not even 206 green parallels for the fucker. So, you see there, it's not really a cost-effective maneuver. He's 500k. Bob Feather right here, he's 36. Uh, you know, neck and neck, nearly about the same price. We have Stan Musial, he's 830. These cards went up. I bought Musial and Willie Mays earlier yesterday. Mike Piazza, nearly max price. The issue is, there's just not many cards of these available. These cards came out in, I think, June. 
So a lot of people that got these aren't playing the game anymore. They're playing Fru Fru Park. They're playing God of War, which comes out tomorrow. I'm so excited. Uh, God of War Ragnarok. Probably do a little streaming for it. Um, but there's just not as many on the market. There's not as many available. So... This is what I'm going to say. This is probably how this is going to happen. I doubt they're putting out any more Takashi cards. 28 is take it or leave it. You can skip two, which, you know, presumably is going to be Walter and one of these cards. You know, Stan, Piazza, Honus, and Raleigh Fingers, the ones that came out in that Takashi featured program earlier in the year. And probably it's not going to loosen its restrictions until after the finest program, which is still three weeks from now. This should be, again, everything is mapped out to be exactly the same. It is control V for content absolutely this year, which it was good in MLB 21. So it's good this year, but you know, you know what to expect is what I'm getting at. So we're going to get one last program after finest year, which is always the one that circles back and gives you the other boss packs from throughout the year. So it's probably not going to be until the end of the finest program that these cards are going to cheapen in price. And Otani's going to be obtainable for the wide majority of people. Because after a while, I don't think we're even going to have these cards on the market. I don't know if there's going to be too many people that are even going to be willing to sell them. Uh, even if somebody's willing to give you a million fucking stubs for that digital card stock, right? So... It is going to be a tough one to obtain. And we have another big collection coming on Friday. I will point to this if you've got the stubs. You know, there's not really much else to spend on. We're going to have that collection Friday. And then we have one more World Series on Monday. After that, World Series and Battle Royale, they're done. They're going to repeat. There's not going to be new rewards in there if it's exactly like it was last year. Which... It is exactly like last year, so Trout's going to be the last BR, and then whoever we get for World Series, that's kind of the big part of content. You know, there's going to be a handful, two, three more events throughout that time. We're probably going to get a little Christmas gift. We got the Bryce Harper Finest last year. Who knows? Is it going to be an IKF this year? I'm not sure. Um... We got a always intense bundle here, I guess. You get two packs. It's such a deal. Let me open it. They pretty much go for 10k quick sell, so you can hardly lose out. Um, hey, you know, that's a, uh, that's a big pull. That's a video title type of pull right there. Insane, must watch. Yeah, yeah you know, hard to say that wasn't worth it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you pretty much break even. It's kind of just a pack opening simulator. Uh, you don't really lose out on anything. In top end, you can't really gain anything. So it's pretty much a push. But that's what we got. World Series, they showed Dusty. They're very happy that he finally got some hardware there. It was cool to see. And yeah, that's kind of where we're at right now. We're getting a milestone program. We've been confirmed on a Cody Bellinger card in that milestone program on uh, that's on Friday. So he's one of the rewards, and otherwise, that's kind of where we're at right now. So let me know in the comment section. Are you guys going after Takashi uh, Otani? Do you think he's worth the price? And uh, yeah, let me know if you guys are ready for Friday. Let me know some big collection predictions. I'm still on the Big Dick Mick train. Well, I am not riding the Big Dick Mick train. I, I, I didn't say that, uh, but I think he's going to be the cart. There we go. Let's... That's a better way of explaining it. Leave a like down below. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys are great today. Thank you for watching.